Before I get out of here and go to the beach and try and get some sun while the weather's still a little nice, I'm going to augment on the video that you watched that directly above this one. First of all, on the Ashkenazi Jews. They are not Semitic and they are a Turkish, Turco-Finnish, mongoloid race from Eastern Europe. Originally from, as I said, the Isles. They are the Gentiles. They're not Semitic. So why have you been under the belief that these are Semitic peoples just because they told you we are God's chosen people? That's not why you swallow the lie. You swallow that lie because you were told that in your churches. So let's talk about churches. First, I'll tell you what Cornwallis said to George Washington after the so-called Revolutionary War about the churches. Then I'll tell you the meaning of churches. And if you have any common, I'm sorry, uncommon sense, because sense is not common, far from it. If you have any sense in that mind or brain of yours, you will comprehend. Cornwallis said to Washington, and I'm going to paraphrase him, and you could get this if you would get a hold of the book. I couldn't even get a hold of the book. I saw excerpts from it. Uh, I watched a video by Tex Mars, and I saw it, and then I tracked it down, and I found out who the author really was. The book is called The Legions of Satan. It was written in 1791, I believe, uh, by a, a so-called... Reverend Jonathan Williams, who turned out to be uh, uh, Jonathan, oh, his name is slipping my, it's on the tip of my tongue, who wrote, oh, I'm sorry, Jonathan Swift, who wrote Gulliver's Travels. He was also an advocate of freedom and a revolutionary against the British government. Uh, in Legions of Satan, Cornwallis stated to Washington that within 200 years, although your country, America, will be known as a bastion of freedom, it will not. All of its inhabitants will be seeking divine world government. All your churches will be perme permeated with Judaism. In other words, the churches will have fell and have been teaching a lie for years upon years. And the world government that they believe to be divine will be nothing more than the British Empire under the rule of the grand architect of, mercenary, of, of masonry, Freemasonry, who the Masons say is Lucifer, but is not. It is Satan. This is why you were taught this in your churches. They have fell. They have fell to the Jews. They have permeated with Judaism. But let's go to the meaning of the word church. And if this don't co co convince you, forget about it. You're hopeless. The word church comes from the Scottish word kirk, which comes from a Greek word called circa, C-I-R-C-E, or circe. Circes was a very evil goddess who would lure sailors or travelers, wayfarers, looking for salvation into her bed. And then she would get them drunk on the wines of illusion and turn them into pigs. If any of you believe a preacher or a televangelist who tells you that the Jews are God's chosen people, you should hang them.